tonight, ladies, gentlemen, and those who do not fall into that binary, we have a new act. And minor illusion with a little few gasps in the audience. Doesn't need to be the real audience only needs to hear the fake audience and they'll they'll pick up the slack. <laughs> and I say and I say our newest act, our newest inductee into syncopation is Florence. And there's like a sound of splashing water that I make with minor illusion because I have that as a cantrip for some reason. But I say, I say, her act is very dangerous, so beware. This act is not for the faint of heart. And then I sort of like, just sort of, as I say that, I sort of inch back over here. But then inch back in once the act starts so that I can do my ring leader shit. Yee. Yee. Very good. Very good. The roll! <laughs> The roll with my blue dice is. Oh. 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 That sounds oh. like a nat one. That's a four plus seven. Uh, four is eleven. Eleven. Oh, eleven. I mean, they're. You know, they're listening. You uh. You unfortunately see about nine of them kind of exit the tent as it's a little packed and they're a little hot and sweaty, so they're just making room. That's fair. But yeah, I mean, all in all, that's not bad. And during Florence's performance, by the way, I would like to um, get out my loot and sort of start plucking a little song sort of faintly in the background, so really only the performer can hear it. Plucking faintly in the background, sort of singing, look at this stuff, isn't it neat? This big ass pool in the middle of this tent, you're gonna rock this performance. Cause you have inspiration. That wasn't the right tones, but you got what I'm saying. Yeah. You have bardic inspiration for the next ten minutes. Yeah. That's a plus. I thought I was gonna, I thought it was one d four. It goes up by level, but I don't know what oh. it is her level. <gasps> oh, excuse me. Um. So, got a quick question. Got a quick. Question. How many? Okay. Here's the question. Is, it is um, indeed a 1d6 for this level of bard. Yeah, it's 1d6 now. Got a quick, got a quick question. Um, the, uh, the, light, uh, the lights that are being provided, I'm guessing those are candles, right? Most likely some form of candle or something cheap, yeah. I was gonna do a little bit of predigitation of Ooh. go out for a all right, that'll that'll give you a nice, you know, plus uh, we'll say plus two for your rolls. They're impressed. Poor, poor doing. Uh, make it feel like it's a little brisk, cold, like slightly cold. All right, so a chill sets in. Before, definitely the you know the candles. Uh, spotlight goes back. To Uh, back on and Florence is sitting there chilling. <laughs> just why not okay. why not okay hmm hmm like kind of like a mermaid for uh, now mermaid kind of po a sitting like ta-da <laughs> And there, I, I cast a bit of minor illusion to make, um, 
No, I don't cast anything yet. I changed my mind. And then... And then probably start off with a flip into the... Uh, All right, a, f a flip? Yeah, and flip into the water. Like, if the water's deep enough to do it... It should be. I mean, it should be. It's... He, he constructed a nice little pool. Yeah. So, uh... Yeah. Do, do your flip. I think that'll be, I guess, acrobatics, or... Yeah, yeah, that would be acrobatic. Okay. So that's what happens. Oh. You have your inspiration die, don't forget. I am, I am. It's got started. I clicked it one too many times. I flipped out with like Uh <laughs> Oh dear. dear. So uh, uh, an eleven. <laughs> well, it's eleven was... plus. You had a two from your prestigious, prestigious blah, blah, blah. Blah, 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 blah. words. Opening. Opening. Uh, so that's not too bad. You do a nice little flip. You know, nothing super super impressive, but it's a nice flip. Yeah. Good job. You a flippin' flipper? <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry, my bad. Oh, God. No, 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 you're good. Um. And we'll say with that, let's see what happens. Oh wow, you guys got a hmm? lucky roll there. Uh, nobody left at all. So yeah. Uh... Cat, I love you, but you are so fucking stupid. Dude. <clears throat> this is why you're her cat, my cat. <laughs> you must put hat on cat. Uh, and or put cat and in hat. I'm going to do the gesture for play, uh, dragon breath, but not on me. I'm going to be on the familiar, and it comes swooping. Okay. So it's gonna s swoop down doing Dragon's Breath? Yes. Alright, that is impressive. That'll add to your performance rolls. Yeah. Oh, but of course, not without maybe some dance. While this is going on? Yeah, I find yeah. a lose in the water flash purple. Very nice. That also gives some some bonuses there. Yeah. We'll say you get another extra two points. So now you're up to bonus of plus four on your performance, plus whatever uh, your bardic, which should I, be I out. Used, I used the bardic inspiration for that acrobatic. It, I believe, one ability check. Yeah. Okay. There it is. Yeah. Um. See, and in the flame that dragon produces, does control a flame. Control flames. Okay, so you're gonna control flames. Mhm. Mm oh, interesting. The water and fire. The inspiration point. Yeah. Hashtag good job. Yeah. Yay. And she's gonna make it into. Like almost in combination with dancing lights, almost like it is. Do it like like a sprite show, kind of like right. maybe a sprite show or a light. Show. So that one will definitely be a uh, performance role. Uh, of course. <clears throat> Wedge is doing all my oohs for me. <laughs> Ooh. Oh. Why 
is a ghost watching this performance? <laughs> so a total of 11, uh, you are able to, you know, control the flames and make it look pretty good. You know, pretty, pretty decently, averagely good. I mean, for your uh, first performance, you're doing great. Even though I'm still questioning why did acrobatics have to have that many rolls in one row? <laughs> uh, minor illusion, more clapping, so the more audience members clap and think it's more impressive. And so it just goes clap, 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 clap. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then... Remember, kids, the clap is so that will do another uh, another plus two. You know, all these minor illusions help. There's a reason you guys are the number one carnival. Yeah. And then try to do a, you know, a ring in the air in which you will jump through it. Ooh. Don't, don't roll a one. Don't roll a one. Well, the thing is that they, she can do... For example, like, the performance is to make it look nice and entertaining. You can do, like, just a circle or whatever. The performance is more sh to make it a show. You know what I mean? Anybody can yeah. jump through a hoop of fire if you let them walk up to it. And, I mean, even honestly, like, to be honest, like, jumping through a hoop of fire is not that dangerous. Yeah, I could, I could like, shamble up to a ring of fire, and if I jump through it, I still feel pretty cool. Yeah. Yeah. But that being the whole point, you know, out of 10, you know, the, the performance is to make it look cool. Yeah. And 12 yeah. plus 6 is 18. It's not bad. So you get a couple oohs yeah. and ahs out of the audience. And you're yeah. able to get uh, one one person to come inside and check out what's going on. In which, if that's the case, then she's just going to go underwater and just like, kind of, is, is the tank see through? Uh, we're gonna assume so, because they want to be able, you know, the audience would, one, be below you, because there's no, like, hole in the ground. It's gonna kind of be underwater, smile. <laughs> Waving. Like, kind of like a sort of... Like, I would say... Yeah. That would make sense. There's my uh, illusion sound of water bubbles. And in the meantime, while she's doing this, like, underwater wave and, uh, wave and smile, the dragon's gonna go through the hoop. Small little pseudo-dragon. Okay. Smile and wave, boys. Smile and wave. So that would be a, so that would be a performance check on the dragon's end. Oh! This is gonna be good. Natural one! Oh! This dragon is not meant to do... Ooh. Mm. Please tell me. Please so that's, tell me. Uh, you know, it's like an 8. Or no, with the 6, it's an 11 or so. Yeah. Uh, and then, I assume you just don't have any bonuses to performance, yes? I don't have any. This dragon doesn't have any. Right. Yeah, so it's, you know, it's pretty basic. It's not the greatest, but it is, you know, your first time performing, so... <laughs> once again, yeah. we're not... A We've, we've already prefaced it, we've had a good show, and, you know, yeah. it's all good. But, uh, yeah, your uh, time for thing is starting to go. You probably got one more part of your act left before the carnival, at least on this side, starts to die down. And people start are already starting to head out. You see, like, roughly, like, 50 people have started to leave, give what? or take. Even if... It's not like that, like I said, it's just getting later in the night. Yeah. And I go around and continue more, uh, uh, asking for coin. Good, good. More or less. My ringleader duty. Yeah. Which we will say, you know, nets you roll your d100. And then, of course, and getting then close I to the end, she might as well have some fun with the dance blades. Change the orbs. Like, as she's, like, pressing on them, make it look like she's changing the colors as she, you know, pointing to them. Oh, okay, cool. Ooh, fancy. It is fancy. Uh, that was a 66. Oh. 
Alrighty, so you were able to get 66 silver coins out of that. How much was for uh, Ivitsa? I didn't write that down. Uh, I don't think we ever did the roll for that one. So we'd have to roll for the D100 for it. 30 something. I we, yeah, it was, I thought we did for him, but not for Gem. Yeah, sorry, that's what I meant, sorry. It was 30 something for Ivitsa. Yeah, either 33 or 37, I think? Something like that? Meet in the middle, go with 35? Sure, sounds good. 35. Excellent. And for Gem? I don't think I we. Can roll that. Yeah, I was gonna say we gotta roll that one. I don't think we ever rolled it. I rolled one hundred. Oh, nice. <laughs> well done. Mm -hmm. Yes. So very good. So you got a hundred silver pieces out of that round for that. Radical. Yeah, it was a good one. Now we continue with our performance. Yes. Uh, yep. And as she's closing, she's gonna do one last spell, burning hands. Oh. And do like a. Like almost like a spitfire, somewhat form of fire form of firework. Ooh. Well, as long as it doesn't burn the ceiling of the tent, you Gucci. <laughs> I mean, she's in water. She should. She should be all right. If you all burn to death, who cares? That's. <laughs> that's wow, Michael. Okay. That's Michael's character's motto. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Jeez. Jeez, are we roasting him now? Always. Uh, to this day, that's gonna be still the funniest thing. I'm like, how do you do that as a druid? Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> We're not talking about my druid. I'm going out to pump myself full of naked back. <laughs> I mean, if, if you were a wildfire druid, I'd be, bad. I would be fun. I'm about that. Very, very bad. <laughs> yeah, this story. Okay, so as the performance is dying down, because I think you're done, right? Yeah, for the most part, like it's said. Okay, so when the performance dies down, and you're you're like doing your like flips in the water or whatever, I w I walk around and I say thank you for coming, thank you for coming, and I do one last pass around for silver. Alrighty, so once again we'll need the uh, the. Performance check and then a D100. Performance check. Good God, good God. Let's go, let's go. That's a nat 20. Ooh, very good. Plus my performance of 7, so 27. Ooh, very, very good. Alright, so you got even more than the base max. And then the D100? Yes. Alright, I pulled myself One full. Shot. I'm ready to continue. Uh, 13. Great. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, it's even worse because it's going to be 7 by 20, so full. Uh, you got 7 because... 7 more. Yeah, 7 silver because uh, remember that about half of them were leaving at the end of that last yeah. round, so there was only about 50 people left out of that 100. Give or yeah. take. Uh, actually, it should have been a little more than that, so maybe... Something like out of 270, and that's why I forgot you got this 272, so it should actually be more like uh, 10. 10 silver. Ten more silver. Yes, more silver. Excellent. Excellent. This, will, this is going into the group group pile of money. Group money. Not confused with my money. My Woo. money is much more important to me. Anyway, yeah. 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 Oh, lovely. So oh, the people it. are, you know, moving out and everything's going pretty well. And then. <clears throat> but wait, there's more. There's more? There's more. Of course there's more. I'm the ringleader. I know that. <laughs> Is there more? <sighs> I mean, there was one person who hasn't performed. Okay. I thought they were in the crowd booing. I thought that was their. <laughs> I was taken out of the crowd by a certain ringleader. I wonder why. <laughs> I know, right? It Wait. just looks like a child. Backs away, you perverts. Backs away farther. <laughs> so I, I, I say, of course. 
How could we possibly forget Syncopation's very own sharpshooter? Yay. Wedge. Wedge, step up. Make your performance, Wedge. For this performance, I need a volunteer. Which you just see Florence drop down into the water like fuck this shit. I'm not gonna be the one to do it. I will stay in this. I will say that this volunteer has to be fearless. And for the audience, that this is not for the faint of heart. Which, by the way, that gets moved back away there. It, it's just gotta get out of the way for the stage. That's just the way it's gotta be. Do I have any volunteers? Uh, so you're gonna need to make a performance check to get, or you're gonna have to make some kind of check to make people get up on stage. Gem is kind of on the ready just in case he decides to pull some crap where he needs more assistance. <laughs> I don't. If you need more assistance, I think it's gonna be a bad day. <laughs> Oh, you know do, yeah. do we not remember the words of fucking uh, Paez, our, our six-armed boss who was literally like, if you kill one more person, I swear to God, <laughs> <laughs> said people do not die on this side of the carnival. Her exact I'm words. Wounds. I'm, gonna, I'm going to uh, do my performance. <laughs> okay. Sorry, I'm just... Nice, that's a good one. That is a good performance check, so... Do I have any takers? Fuck you! <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, you do have a taker. Alright. They're like, what's all this then? What do you do? Well... Why do you got a mm, faggy doll on your shoulder? Whoa. <laughs> hey, some people out I, there I, I are not they, accepting they the people. I grab him. Most, mostly the ignorant. Very I pull him to the center of the stage. I tell him to stay there for a moment. I go to the other side of the tent. I pull up a roulette wheel. Alright. And then I strap him. <laughs> to the roulette wheel. Oh no, if I've consented to all this then! <laughs> you volunteered, good sir. Right. But have no fear. I am really good. I do. And I, I walk, I sort of go around, do my whole, like, ringleader thing, and I'm like, yes, yes, don't worry, he's done this many, many times, he's, it's completely safe, don't worry, but don't move a muscle. And I poke <laughs> his knee. That's, that's, that's where I kind of look at her, kind of confused, like, really? I've done this before? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Some, yes, you have. <laughs> yeah, just, just take it, just... I go back to where I got the roulette, roulette wheel, and I grab my bow, and I come back, I stand about 30 feet away. Ringleader, if you would be so nice, give it a good spin. Of course. And I, I fucking, I fucking spin the wheel. So as he's spinning there, I pull out one of my arrows, quivers on my back. Do, 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 do. Axel, choose high or low. Oh lord, high, I guess. It's not All my right. fault, by the way. If, if you are correct, it is a normal arrow. If you are wrong, it's a poisoned arrow. Nice. Oh, it's a normal arrow. Look at that. Mm. And uh, I'm going to lose an arrow aimed at just under where his armpit is. <laughs> All right, don't uh, uh, don't miss <laughs> or do, do I guess? That, do you want me to make that as a performance or a actual attack? That's a good question. I'm guessing for this, especially since it's a sharpshooting tactic roll, this would be a very specific attack roll that okay. would require a skill check and then an attack roll. A, a skill check into an attack roll. Yes. All right. So you want to make it a dex skill check? Yep. Just All a basic right. dexterity skill check. So that's one d twenty. Because you're calling your shot here, basically, and a very specific shot at that. And he's on a rotating wheel, so good. I hope you have right. really good pluses for this guy. 
<laughs> Here's my 1d20 plus 3 for the dex. Now it's just saying rolling dice, it's not doing anything. Oh, shit! Okay. So you have taken your stance and you believe that you are good to go to shoot. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Has anybody got some good anybody got some good illusion magic? <laughs> you're gonna need to you're gonna need to cover the sound and the image. <laughs> So uh, let's see, let's see that attack roll, my friend. Yep, yep. Let's see. No, 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 no. Thank God. He's like, wait a minute, wait a minute. What's like? Seven. I have a plus seven by attack roll. I don't know if that's a good thing right uh, now. Can your minor illusions of like cannon fire? <laughs> over and over. So here's my attack roll. Cool oh, shit. Well, then you hit what you were aiming for. Uh, however. And this is gonna be fun. Something, uh, you're not sure what, hits your hand as you're shooting. Can can I do a perception check? Uh, sure. Oh no! You are you are you're gonna have to take a disadvantage. Uh, we're we're gonna see once I roll this dice. You're gonna have to take a disadvantage on this uh perception right, so roll. I'll roll it. I'll roll it as 2d20 plus 3, and you'll take the lower than 2d20s. Yeet. Oh, no. Oh, oh, sorry, sorry. It did not, uh, sorry, it did not uh, hit your hand. It grabbed your ass. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what? That's oh, also no. why the perception check's hard to that's, see. That's, that's 18, 18 plus, plus three. 3. So you noticed the hand was small and uh, wouldn't, and there's no one else besides you. Um, on my shoulder. <laughs> um, what? Oh, no. uh, but uh, now I need. Uh, what do I need? I need. Oh goodness. Yeah. I need a D. Is that an eight? Damn it! This is a real tough one to actually do for this. I'm, I'm gonna go with a D10. One D10. Any bonuses? Uh, nope. Did it hit him? We're about Did to see. We're about to oh. see. Why oh. is it taking forever on the rolling dice? Sometimes it does that. It's like a loading thing. Nine. Nine. So. Oh, sorry. I wanted a line, but that's fine. Assuming that one is here and ten is here, you shot... This way. <laughs> oh, no. Directly into the exiting crowd. <laughs> By the way, all random. I guess it could have gone this directly this way into your other performance person, but I just did it by random from one to ten. Like it came around and spun. Yes, minor, minor illusion to. to Change the course of the arrow and wait to change the, the to, 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 to make it seem like I'm like making this arrow fucking roll around. <laughs> I was about to say, it's like, Minor Illusion is a great spell, but uh, it is so definitely I still an illusion. Go that way, but she basically, she's got a Minor Illusion to make it seem like it comes back. Yeah. It's just how it looks. Yeah, but what about the sound and the. <laughs> uh, I got an idea. Can, can, I can't can believe I'm fucking one on the desk. Is this what you get for telling me not to roll a one? Here's First of all. For, yeah, yeah, that's. But but then here's the thing. I roll a nat twenty, and then on the yeah, then, I roll then, a nat twenty. Yeah, 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 that's yeah. that's why it was great because uh, you missed. Then you hit the twenty, which meant you were gonna hit that guy, hundred <laughs> percent. And then uh, the doll hit your hand. And fucking... Uh, no, his ass. Oh, right, that's right. Grabbed his ass. Uh, and, uh... Man. 
sworn Tomilia can grab that before it hits someone in the ground. I don't know, man. That's. And it's coming in clutch. I'm gonna try to misty step, which doubles my not misty step. Yeah, no, I, I was gonna say misty step allows you to teleport up to thirty feet. Well, I, I was wrong thing. It's um step of the wind oh, yes. that doubles my speed. Essentially. Uh. I feel like. I was gonna try to <laughs> um, deflect missiles, but I realized <laughs> before I got to say this that that's probably too long. <laughs> I, uh. <laughs> Notice and then act on it. Yeah, this is a very split second. Like he's aiming, you see him, and you're like, "Wait, is he aiming directly at this mother?" And then, boom, he shoots into the middle of the other end of the crowd. <laughs> Bas basically, I just like to imagine. I just like to imagine like mm, Legolas or someone just like, "I've got it," and then, ooh, and. Mm. <laughs> I could also say my illusion lasts for one minute, so there's still cannon fire going off as I minor illusion the arrow another way. <laughs> uh, I mean that can definitely work. You can you can yeah. run it like that. You're just gonna have to get maybe get rid of a body. <laughs> uh, I, we're gonna see because he still hasn't rolled damage for that crit. I mean, I like no, it's not a crit. Remember? Oh, oh wait, no. No, you rolled the damage for crit. You rolled the oh, dex yeah. for crit fail. You did the opposite ends oh, of the spectrum, no. so you get double damage on this thing. Plus. Okay, so one d eight plus three. <laughs> Please tell me there's a. So that's that technically one d eight times one. two plus one three. Eight. Yeah, one d eight times two plus. Do I have to put the parentheses in there? Uh, I can't remember for this one. You might for the orders to go right on the dice. I don't know how oh, they count the dice roll, if it's counted as a multiplier or its own we, little... We'll, we'll see if this is right. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that should be right. So, yes. So that's 13 damage. <laughs> let, me, let me check something. Please tell me this dragon can grab... The pseudo-dragon can grab that arrow before it hits... It's fine, I have healing magic. So... <laughs> <laughs> you know, it, it... It, um... It would be fine. We'll, we'll get to it. So, we'll start with the things that may or may not be able to do. So, what we have currently... We'll break down the situation as best we can. We have a... What is almost assuredly a bad thing... <laughs> headed this that. way. Say what? Man, that is the worst arrow of all time. But, we got arrow oh. heading this way. Bad. Bad times. <laughs> um, We have someone who wants to try to run up and stop the arrow. Which is technically, you know, in travel. No, no. I don't want to stop the arrow. You're pressed. You're... That's I'm not right. a monk. I'm just heading that direction. Okay. Then we have a pseudo dragon, which is right here for now. Although I don't know where it actually is because it didn't get moved after the performance. So that's technically. It <laughs> would theoretically be around you, I'm guessing, but yeah. it could be anywhere. Uh, which can try to maybe either A intercept or knock out course. Um, yeah. That is going to be like a legendary reaction feat. I mean, it can fly It's not there, impossible. But... It's It can get there. The problem being that you're... One, it's during his turn. So theoretically, during his turn, the arrow travels its full distance. So you're interjecting an action into his turn, like a reaction. Which... We're just doing it for the sake of why not. Because this is... <laughs> <laughs> but... So that would require a legendary uh, feat, in my opinion... You know, someone correct me wrong. But that would take a legendary feat of speed and agility to either intercept and knock the arrow off course or even get in the way of it. Um, no, that's not my poison arrow. <laughs> so that, that, all that is, is uh, a roll, right? You're going you're gonna to roll 
basically for reaction, which I'm is basically dexterity, and then you're going to roll. Goodness, what are we gonna have you roll to do fucking that feat of heroic bravery? I, I feel like that's pretty much just athleticism. Like athletics, you are just booking it. The dragon is just booking its ass over there as fast as possible. It is sprinting in the middle of time and space and and D and D rules to make this happen. So let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking wedge. <laughs> Why? Why? Why did you have to do this? <laughs> so this is a Dexter string. Uh, first one is going to be Dex. Then the second one, Strength. Please. What a, is the sixteen good? I mean. It's good, but it's not legendary. Yeah, I don't know if that's legendary. <laughs> let's see what your second. Let's see what your second roll is. Let's see. Maybe, maybe you can scrape by with a nat twenty on the second. Just book, make up for skill with power. <laughs> nah, I'm. I'm gonna go with the unfortunate no. <laughs> this dragon cannot get in the way. Oh, in time. No. There's just no way. Nobody's close to in the way. Nobody has a reactive spell they can use here that would work. I mean, I mean, technically, I do have shield, but no, it's on. That's, that's it's on so. Yeah, no. So here's what here's what I'm I'm gonna do to save this. I'm gonna save this act. I the person falls. There's still cannon fire going off. They can't hear the person screaming. <laughs> oh, you assume they're screaming. <laughs> Are they dead? <laughs> he hit a common person with a 13. Do you know how much a common person has in 5e? Okay, Four um... health. <laughs> oh, he tripled no. the damage. He basically shot them directly through the face. <laughs> oh, no. Like, you ever see, you ever see that scene? In the scene in, in goddamn Game of Thrones with the kid running across the field and he just keeps shooting arrows at him until BAM! Mm -mm. Dunzo! Mm -mm. Mm -mm. See, see, see. Oh, god. oh my god! Oh my god! That's why I, that's that's why I knew too. I was like, he was, you were so fucked. Even if he had gotten the minimum amount of damage, it would have been like six or seven. It would have been bad. So, so what I do is I run up to the person who has now fallen down. Everyone's kind of looking at him like, what the fuck? I cast minor illusion to make him look like a regular fucking person, <laughs> not one that's missing a fucking skull. All right, I feel like this is gonna be a couple of rolls again. <laughs> <laughs> Not necessarily on the level of legendary, um, so, but there's gonna be a couple rolls here. We got uh, one for sure. This is, oh, man, that like I feel like you're casting under pressure here. <laughs> yeah, I'm under pressure. Um, my whole plan, my whole plan is to cast minor illusion, make him look like a regular person, then pick him up, like sort of like. Make it like weekend of <laughs> I was waiting for the reference. Sometimes <laughs> <laughs> I say to the crowd around me, you know, sometimes our performances are just so knockout <laughs> that sure. they just sometimes make people fall unconscious. <laughs> Go about your day. <laughs> I will see you this one personally with my very own medical experience. So, I mean, I feel like uh, you're going to need to do for one performance, two deception. And, uh, and a persuasion. Oh my God. I was not necessarily persuading them to do anything yet. They're trying to let them take their own grasp of the situation by performing and lying. So it's kind of like, uh, you know, acting like you're doing. You're not actually trying to convince them or like, it's, it's tough to explain, but... You shouldn't necessarily need a persuasion on that because he's not trying to get them to leave or mentioning basically, for them to leave. Basically, I'm deceiving everyone into thinking everything's fine. Yes, yeah, so he's just trying to make them not know that they're dead. <laughs> oh, boy. This is performance. This is performance. 15 plus 7. It's pretty good. 22. Performance. 
All right, so you. Well, I'm you, everything is fucking fine. Okay, so there will be there will be a couple things, but all right, so for sure, your performance is good. It looks like uh, the the person or whatever it is walking themselves at the very least. That's that's what I was <laughs> judging that part of that performance on. Okay. Um, okay. So then deception. Oh, is there more? Go ahead. Y y uh, deception. No, no, you're good. I'm trying to think of after that what's going down. <laughs> Alright, deception. Ah. Mm, that's an 8 plus 6. Uh, 14. 14. 14. <laughs> Please. For the love of all this dignified, this is getting out of hand. <laughs> this is all because the trap so it was, to go. it was a 14, right? 14. Oh. It was like... So a couple of them are like, man, you know, whatever, and they turn around and like, you know, show's over, I guess, or, you know, what happened show's here? Over. What's, uh, you, know, over. you know, what's, uh, what's, but then the other one's like, oh, what happened? I thought he was shooting at the person on stage. He, he was. It was an illusion all along. <laughs> <laughs> he's Please. just laughing, <laughs> laughing as he says this, but mind you. <laughs> <laughs> yes, nothing to fear, nothing to fear, everyone is fine. This man is just so overcome with shock at our amazing sharpshooter, who was so good that <laughs> this man on the wheel didn't take any damage at all. Then I stop him spinning. <laughs> Oh, man. Uh, so... But where's the arrow, you ask? Why, it went straight through the wheel. Right at, 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 which, <laughs> at which point the people behind are like, We don't see an arrow! That's you because see the arrow? it degraded from the speed it was trapped. Ooh, <laughs> deception check. <laughs> Alright. Oh. Can, can I assist? Is, it, is he an advantage because I'm assisting with the arrow hole? Sure. You have advantage. What's my What's my deception? Plus two? Alright. And I'll do the 2d20 plus two, and since it's advantage, we'll take the highest. Uh, oh! An 18! Not bad, not oh. bad. So they, they're like, oh! Ooh. And the guy's like, I'm not convinced. <laughs> Why isn't he talking or moving around or any of that good shit? Cause he's unconscious. Shh. This guy that I'm that I'm walking with. Yeah. And I, I Why are you walking with him anyway? I told you our performance is just so shocking that sometimes people just go unconscious. We're so <laughs> that we. <laughs> he's gonna he's gonna take a deeper look at this. He's at my this. Illusion. Fine. Well, I mean, this is and isn't true sometimes. As, um. <laughs> your okay, spell. I, what's I, your spell save DC again? <laughs> my spell save DC. I've, it's probably about 14 or 16. 15. 15? 15. Okay. There it is. All right. I just couldn't. It's, it's in a weird space on the sheet. Uh, let's see. Oh my god. <laughs> It's because I roll to the DM, but I rolled the 16. But one second, I didn't check this, and I always forget to check. Uh, oh no, that's right. Commoners have the basest of base stats. They're all tens. That's all plus zero, plus zero, plus zero. Plus zero. I see he doesn't believe me, so yeah, I. I say, you know what, dear sir, I go up to him and I put, it, put my hand on his shoulder and say, you know what, good sir, I think now would be an excellent time for you to go get some food. So I suggest you go out, out of this tent right now. So now and that... Get some food and never tell anyone what, you're, what you've seen here. So that is persuasion. For sure. That is the spell suggestion. Oh, you're using suggestion. Sorry, I was un I was unsure. All right, suggestion. Oh man. It's a wisdom save. Oh man, the commoner's got to get a good save here. Nope, spell couldn't roll good forever. Hell 
Hell yeah. He's like, I so, think I will, you uh, you suspicious looking person, and then walks off. <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget to check the uh, DMs. Oh, sorry about that. Thank you, Diffy. Sometimes I get a little distracted with the. Oh wow. And so. Oh my God! All right, so you just hear like some voice in the crowd yell, "Oh shit! Is that guy dead?" <laughs> oh my <wait>, what? And... <laughs> oh my God! No. <laughs> So let's do a roll here. Uh, I'll let you guys choose. Uh, 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 roll a d100. Okay, I'll. Uh, do you want me to roll? Whoever wants to for this one, I just don't want to be responsible. I want everyone to be able to see the roll, and all my macros are set to personal. So. Oh, everyone see the roll. How do I roll on d100? How do oh I roll well, on? never mind then. Whoever uh, Mike will roll a d100. Fine. <laughs> Seventy-two. There we go. So. I was told to roll a D one hundred. What the fuck? <laughs> Oops, my I was already typing. Either. <laughs> Too slow. Exactly. No, fuck you. There's my D one hundred. It's a fifty. All right. So, um, out of. We'll take the middle ground and say sixty. Out of the. Hundred uh, sixty. Only half of the people had remained, or out of the 100 people that had originally been in the tent, only roughly half or less remained. So only 30 people, as opposed to 60 people, uh, heard that. <laughs> and they just kind of look over. Um, and I wasn't given a thing, so now I'm going to make a roll and just do, we'll say, for, so that sound came from over here. So everyone kind of looks over there. Over where? One, one sec, let me see. Where? Wait a minute. I think I got a stupid idea. Hold on. Wait. I. Okay. What's your idea? Uh, cause I do have alter self. And I just need to get, uh, he's wearing pretty much commoner clothes, right? Yeah. Ah, I see what your plan is. Oh. If I can sneak over there, this is going to work. You're gonna have to do the old switcheroo, though. Which, I mean, yeah. you guys are carnies, you got this. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, I come over here, kinda, kinda... So, um, uh, actually the sound came from kinda over here. Near the body. Okay, so I say... That's where the body is? Right over here? Uh, let's see. Originally... In. Originally, let's say the body started roughly here. So if it's okay. been moved and picked up, which dragging a body is roughly, I believe, unless in, unless it's not over your weight limit, which is might not be. Depends on your strength. Uh, it'll, like, um, half your movement speed or so. Well, my strength is... 12. So, with the 12 strength. Really need my old D&D board, or my DM board. I know for a 10, you can pick up a person who's your size, as long as neither of you are holding anything. So, standard carrying capacity is about 15 times your strength score. That's how much weight you can carry. 15 times my strength. I can't fucking do that math. So, okay. 15 by 15 would be roughly, I believe. 180. Yeah. I can pull 180 pounds. There you go. As uh, we'll, we'll save my my shitty math for later. Me. So, I, I kind of dragged him this <laughs> way. I was like, before you go, are we prepping for a tent fire? Yeah, they they've been uh, preparing distractions just in case this goes bad. Yeah, I, I saw that. That was uh, funny. Um, um, I Meanwhile, Michael to... has helped zero times. <laughs> yeah, I said to the voice that I heard. I say, no, no, he's not. He's not dead. Remember, I said this is just such a shocking performance. Sometimes people just fall unconscious of fright. 
from from our uh, amazing performance, our amazing feats of bravery, and then I walk over to our dear friend the butcher over here, and I I un do his his bindings to the wheel and I say to the amazing bravery of our butchers he's gonna look he's gonna look at you he's like do I get paid for this I put two gold pieces in his hand oh shit he's like fuck yeah and he jumps off the stage and runs out <laughs> I swear to god I'm gonna come out and uh, keep in mind make sure it comes out of the sharpshooter's <laughs> not the mermaid that did nothing. <laughs> it's not gonna come out. I, I handed that to the, him, not because I didn't have any. I didn't. Get, well, I wasn't given any gold. I was given silver. I know. So I know. I, two gold from my. I know, but you. I know. I know. Yo. Um, oh my goodness. The group. Yeah. The group so, joke. So, the guy is gone. There's, the crowd is filtering out. Did we pass that fucking fuck up successfully? All right, so we we, we got rid of the guy on the uh, wheel. Yes. Uh -huh. uh, yeah. We still have people looking towards the body <laughs> because uh, so of the vo because of the voice that has now called out attention to the dead body. So In I'm I'm talking and like talking very anim adamantly like anim animatedly so you're gonna you're so trying to get their attention yes i'm having people look at me and it's i'm wearing i should i should have described this earlier i'm wearing the sparkly gold outfit oh that's okay like that's like you know in those like um like the when you picture like carnival outfits it's like for a girl it's like she's wearing fishnet stockings and like it's like a jacket that's long in the back but short in the front and she got like little shorts on. So a tail coat jack. Yeah, it's basically that. And she's got on shorts, and it's all gold, and it's kind of like parts of it are sequins, so she's kind of sparkly. And there's like little like makeup, like gold makeup on her cheeks, so she's very, very, very pretty. And people are people. She's designed to be looked at at that point. Alrighty. Designed to get people to look at her. Instead of the dead body across the fucking tent. Got a quick question. Did my stealth do anything? What's your stealth? Uh, cause I had rolled it to, uh, Axel. Oh, sorry. Oh. I just now saw it. Uh, that? You know, well, let's say in the middle of this panic it does. Yeah, so she's gonna try to, you know, like I said, <laughs> go through with the plan of making it look like she, it, she looks like the person and use the last like spell slot she has for alter soul. All right. Um, I'm gonna we're gonna take that as a perception run because you're trying to kind of mimic them and pretend to be yeah. them. Or not perception. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we'll do perception and then as a performance. So one and then the other. Yeah. My suggestion: don't roll low on the first one and high on the second one. Then you will look like someone really different. <laughs> okay. That is a good performance. And, okay. Because I and mean then perception. Yeah. Should oh, also my. be fine. Everyone's dropping like flies. So with that being said, uh, we're gonna go ahead and say that you were able to successfully kind of look at him and get a good, good shape of him. And. If she can, can she stealthily put this body somewhere else, like move him, so that this can be handed to you later? I did say that I sat him down, so he's like sitting on a chair in the audience, so you could just like push him over, so he's on the ground. <laughs> just try to hide him real quick. <laughs> yeah, Might hide him. Are they uh, a bleacher? Well, there's probably a little bit kind of bleacher setup, but it's not like super big risers or whatever, you know. Mm -hmm. Pretty moderate you could bleachers. Put him behind a bleacher. Yeah. Potentially. Okay. Uh, I was also gonna say you were trying to attract attention, and I forgot what your yeah. role was for that. Oh, I didn't roll, so I'll roll. No worries. I'll let's say performance, I guess. Cause I don't see one called distraction. Okay. Um. So. Uh, performance, you said. 
I was thinking that, yeah, you know, to get people's attention. That's a nine. Hmm. So, you know, you got you got about half of their attention. Give a little less. A little less. It's like. <laughs> I love this chaos I have made. It completes me. <laughs> But then when there's then when we go into the weird town, he's just freaking out. <laughs> Benjamin Bartholomew, yeah. make up your minds. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, it's gonna get weird. You don't even know. So, uh... Oh, Jam, no! Oh God, I don't notice it, but oh God. Please show me. Is what was that? That's me on the map. Excuse me. Hey, you D. saw I nothing. See. Nothing. Don't worry about it. You don't need to worry about it. Uh, can I try to stop him from leaving? Actually, I've words for him. <laughs> Wait, is he leaving? Leave, <laughs> <laughs> but I want to try to stop him from leaving. Yeah, that's good because this is about the time I wanted this to happen anyway, so this is all works out. <laughs> Oh, heck no, he is not leaving. <laughs> so, um... I have to stop him from leaving. But on a different note, do I manage to pull off this, uh, shock, uh, this lovely shock for uh, me, right? We're gonna uh, say yes, you're you're able to do that. You'll have to do a stealth check to hide them. Okay. How do I stop Wedge? Do I have to roll? Okay, why? <laughs> Did Nightmare... <laughs> Um, yeah, people are like, what the f are you doing? Why is that person going under the bleach? <laughs> like, just two or three people around you. It's not like everyone, but like, it's just a couple of them like, wait, is he uh, really dead? No, 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 he's fine. He's fine. <laughs> I just love, I just love the terrible lies in person. It's just like, no, he's fine. It's like, he's sleeping. He's like, oh, it's like, couldn't, there's no like good lies. Like, oh, it's like the combat dummy that we use for the fucking crowd or something. It's like, no, he's a person. He's totally fine. He's got an arrow in his fucking face. It's, it's invisible right now. Seriously, I'm flying right here. Like I said, that performance was really a knockout. <laughs> oh my god! All right, He's so. Really trying to sell this. <laughs> <laughs> Save this guy. Um, I guess roll deception. <laughs> advantage on that because she's following my party line. Yeah, we'll we'll give her. I'm. Yeah, we'll give her advantage. Let's see how she does with it. Uh, wait a minute. Where'd where'd my stuff go? Where is your stuff? Where did you go? My, my character is gone! Where'd it go? With advantage? With Wait, ten? where did your character go? I don't- I don't know, but I remake him. Alright, you put him back where he would. <laughs> well, um... Anything that Jem would see that she could try to catch fire that's not the actual tent at first? So, I mean, you've got the stage, you got the stands. The stands and the stage are both made of wood because they need to be easy to set up and take apart. Um, the the tent itself, obviously, is burnable. Yeah, the, the tent is you've, an obvious one, but she's trying to avoid that you, one because she feels like she'd get in trouble. Yeah, those are really <laughs> kind of your options at the moment. I guess you got the wheel. Are there How civilians the near the wheel? Not Anymore. really. I mean, direct. the civilians are mostly, like... Where's my free hand? Probably like here. Where that pink glob is. Oh wait, did I put it on the wrong? God damn it! I don't see a pink, a new pink blob. There we go, new pink blob. Okay. Probably the general <laughs> area of the crab. Now I must go delete <laughs> something on another layer. <laughs> oh no, we lost Ashley. <laughs> Essentially, she's just like, yeah, this guy he, he, he suffers from just falling asleep out of the sudden. That too. Um, oh, what's that? Oh. Just... Narcolepsy. That yes. One. Yes. Wait, yes, there's no sound coming. Like that. Oh no, shit, it's on her end. Sorry, my bad. 
And do I have to do I have to roll anything to keep Wedge here? Um, probably, yeah. Mm, yeah, probably. You're, you're either gonna have to physically keep him here or try to convince him to stay. I'm going like the grabbing the back of the collar, or, like grabbing. The oh back well, back then yeah, that's a like that's probably a strength or grapple check. Wait, wait, what is she grabbing at? I'm grabbing at you. Make sure you don't leave, because I'm just like. You don't get to leave yet. You don't get to leave yet. We're having words, but I'm not saying anything. I'm just trying to convince you that we're all fine. Everything's fucking fine. No. And uh, then the, you, you, you have to clean up. We have to help clean up. I thought you said something about grabbing the doll. And I was about to be like, mm, no, 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 no. <laughs> like the arm or the back of the collar, but it's like the arm is where I ended up going with. Oh, yeah. So the here with my great strength of 12 is. Okay, 17 plus. Uh, 1, so 18. Alright, Wedge, you gotta resist that. Am I resisting it with a strength as well? Uh, a strength or an uh, or acrobatic. Yep. Uh, athletics or. Yep, athletics or acrobatics, pretty much. Huh. Only on defense, though. Well. I guess it doesn't matter which one I use, because I have a plus three to both of those. Well, there you go. Uh, I have a feeling it's going to be bad for me. And I will do it with a... Well, let's go with acrobatics to dodge it. Come on, baby, give me a good roll. No. Oh! oh! Yeah, so you try to stop him, and he, like, pulls you over. Like at the air. Yeah. Well, that was like a grapple, so you got a hold of him and just overpowered you. you did. Yeah. And, oh, and okay, as, so as I kind of like, like go to flip her over, I kind of stop her. I'm gonna kind of like stop her before she hits the ground, and then just kind of drop her when she's like an inch from the ground. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm gonna give a little smile, wave, and then walk off. <laughs> <laughs> Hit him with a thunderbolt. And it's like, <laughs> and then, uh, bam! Just, just 30 damage. Bam! Like, shit. <laughs> it's like, alright, I'll see you when you wake up. <laughs> I feel like the bards have a spell. You might not have it, but I feel like they have a spell that makes people either attack you or <laughs> do something like that. <laughs> Uh, having said that, before this goes any further, uh, something does happen that I did plan. Maybe. Uh, oh boy. I, I love how I get nat 20s on things I don't really need nat 20s on. <laughs> the fuck is that? It's so, uh, as you uh, are doing this, suddenly through the walls of the tent, a elephant rips through <sighs> as it begins its stampede. Oh shit! And I can't angle them quite correctly, but they're actually kind of going this way towards the stage. And that oh, finishes well. their movement on that turn, but they definitely ran over some people, and this one hit part of the stage. I'm prone, right? Currently? Well, I did kind of drop her on the ground. Yeah. Lightly, you know, she was like an inch off. Well, I... this is a reminder too. So grapples don't have to be like grapple grapples. Grapples can also be grabbing someone from behind, uh, trying to get out of like a full Nelson. It's not always like you know a wrestling, uh, you know, lockup. The grapple is just used to determine how your strength is played into it. So how she was grabbing your arm from behind, the grapple win could be as simple as you know pulling your arm away. But the crit was the deciding factor in basically, like, pulling her off her feet. Yeah, 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 yeah. And now aiming at elephants. Good, good plan. <laughs> great, 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 Awesome, perfect. So, awesome. I got an elephant. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm going to assume that I can easily see and hear these elephants crashing through the stadium, right? No, roll up and check. No, I'm just kidding. Oh, well. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Only you, everybody else, yes, but you have to <laughs> roll. I should just stay on the ground and let the elephants fucking trample me. Um, I'm going to uh, grab onto her arm and I'm gonna like pick her up and 
run away from the elephants in the direction they're not stampeding. Because I may be a dick who loves chaos. I'm not an outright murderer to people I don't. It's just an accidental murder to people he doesn't know. Yeah, with that. no remorse at all. Just outright comedy. It's like, I just shot that person in the face. Ha 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 ha. So, uh, what, what kind of check do you want me to make for that? You make um, strength, reflex. I guess strength and reflex. So a strength to, like, see if I, like, can get her up, up. yeah, and then right, and, and then reflex to get the fuck out of the way. All right, baby, one d twenty plus one for my strength. On, ooh, eighteen. So that's my strength. All right, eighteen strength should be more than enough. All right, and this is for my dex. Come on, come on, woohoo, eighteen. Oh, nice. So, I mean, that should be enough to get you guys out of the way. I mean, which way out of the way is kind of up to you. Uh, I plan on going... Where's my jigger doodad? That way. Alright, well, Where's with your immense myself? strength, you should not be hampered in your movement speed, so... So, yeah, we move up this way. Out of the path of the stampeding elephants. Only fonts, you so say? <laughs> Sorry. I say that almost makes up for you killing that guy. I got no idea what you're talking about. This has been a fun time. And I'm leaves out the him. back of the tent. <laughs> someone, someone shoot him with lightning. Just shoot him with lightning. I oh no! Meanwhile, there is still an elephant stampede in the fucking. <laughs> Wait, can I? Oh, do I do that? Oh, I don't do anything. And a different note, um... Wait a minute, since I was in the stands trying to impersonate this guy, right? Yeah, you might want to get out the way, Jewel. Yeah, as well as kind of keep it <laughs> grab onto since this his, guy. Since his body was right about there. Yeah, so I dragged him in. I dragged him in. Yeah. Somewhere like around here, like right on the edge. Like right around there. <laughs> Maybe there, actually. Right here ish. <laughs> but still, moving away. Moving. <laughs> uh, oh, God. Uh, <sighs> layer wedge. <laughs> Look, uh, and you guys really said nobody, but you guys will know if you murder him in the night. <laughs> I was like. <laughs> I mean, could the idea get vengeance? Oh gosh, yeah. no, no, this is gonna happen. A long list of somewhere, somehow, lo and behold, Florence turns out is. No how? Axel, I DM'd you. Oh, there we go. More DMs, yes. Make sure she's still out of the way. I'm gonna back up a little bit more. <laughs> in the edge of the thing. Yeah. It's gonna go. Definitely, Florence is gonna head towards the back of the tent so this can be sorted. Can I tell why these elephants are running? Um, the, you, you can this like not just off the bat, but you can make a roll or try to talk to them, etc. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm. I don't know if I want to cast speak with animals. Ugh, because they're kind of running and they're kind of stampeding, so it might not do any good. Um, I am going to cast. Uh, no, I'm not. I'm just going to. Can I roll? Can I roll like a perception to see if I can tell if they're running from something? Yes. Well, okay, that's a five plus perception, uh, nine. Nine. 
They're fucking running elephants, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, elephant stampede, yo, just happens all the time. Yeah, I mean, it just happens. Sometimes there are elephants and sometimes they stampede. No big. Yeah, but in the meantime, yep, there it goes. Um, Lord's more still as this guy is going to, you know, put this guy <laughs> where he can be healed at some point. You can I mean, I mean, people can. They're just really light healers. All right, so you guys hear some shouting, like in random, just draconic. Um, draconic. I know somebody does. Uh, I have a quick question. Axel. Yeah, I'm. I'm typing you. I was about to say. This would be a golden question. Ah. Bare necessities, the simple bare necessities. <laughs> um, where is that no strap? Yeah. Any, anyway, um, Florence can get a good idea of where, uh, who, where is it coming from? Like, where is this character at? Should be, uh, you would have to, I'd say, do perception for that. Just to determine uh, the area of which it's coming from. Perception? Yeah. Oh, well then. Yeah, um, sounds like it's coming from over here. And she is going to march over there. Probably still dressed up as this guy and wanting to... <laughs> it gives him the look of what the heck. Uh, so Flor very up there, he pissed the horse right now. Qua. Clarence. Yeah, that's not, you, 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 you know what? No, after this shenanigans, she's going to gesture to the fact that she's still prancing around as. Yeah, <laughs> looks lovely. Great. I'm off to find Clarence now. You no, know, you're not. Uh, yes, I am. Billy, you heck, you're not. And he's gone. <laughs> 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 he just took off! Cause I did wonderfully at trying to figure out where Clarence was. Oh wow. Yeah, he did not do yeah, a good I roll. I can't roll for shit now cause I used up all my 20s and high rolls, baby. <laughs> Shooting innocent people in the back of the face. <laughs> I'm gonna tell Taz. I'm gonna call mom. Sounds good. Have fun. You know, uh, speaking of, of I don't know if you noticed her down here. <laughs> speaking of, as you, uh, you just, mm, by the way, this was down here earlier, by the way. Just no one looked. Oh, yeah, she, she was down there. I saw. Yeah, she's just going to be like, what the fuck? <laughs> um, hearing that, Jeb's going to go put out the arrow that's been on fire this entire time and then put her bow away. I'm gonna I'm gonna run up and be like and be like don't worry don't worry everything's fine everything's totally fine. Uh, Florence is going to. This Florence. This, this don't look fine. Florence is going to drop altar so and very much look at the guy that's probably very much dead. You didn't say. Do we do we have a cleric on staff? Going to go hang out with Clarence and be like, hey. I've been right here the entire time, haven't I? I didn't do any of this, right? <laughs> so, I I talked with Paez, and I'm like, everything is exactly fine. Paez, everything's great. It's great. And you can sort of see, like, there's like a little bit of mania around her eyes. 
Everything's not great, Paz. Everything's not great. Everything's not going very well, Paz. Paz looks and she's gonna look down for a moment. Look around. Uh, heave a deep sigh and put three of her six arms, like, on her head. Just, like, leaning into it. Two fingers just like, oh my god, my job. Just what am I doing here with my life? I'll have you know. I'll have you know, Paz. I this is my first time ring leading, and I did so good, Paz. She's gonna. Really she's good. just gonna look up and be like, "Where the hell is Gunter?" I don't know, Paz. I she's, don't know. she's gonna. She's just gonna look over. And she's like, "There's people that are just squish grapes now in your tent. What? Yeah, ha what yeah, happened?" I don't know. I don't know. The elephants came in. Wedge did something stupid. Our performance was going to go awesome. It was going to go perfect, Paz. And Wedge did something. And now he's gone. He's fucked off somewhere with his weird sex doll. And... <laughs> <laughs> Again! I think... <laughs> Just again, you say. What? 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 What'd I say? No, it's like he, she's just gonna say, again you say? <laughs> she's just like, I thought I told you guys not another dead body. I, I can't even count! I have six hands and I can't count how many people are dead right now. Uh, uh, elephants uh, We had nothing to do with elephants. Where, where even are you? <laughs> she's yeah, just like, every, everyone get out here! <laughs> But I'm talking to Clarence. No, no, the heck you're not. <laughs> this is me. <laughs> I do as I'm told, and I walk out of the tent. I gotta do some side stuff here. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. All right, I gotta copy pieces. Why? Why did I do this? <laughs> da 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 da. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. And then on to the next one. Did the elephants walk away, by the way? Are they gone now? Uh, no, they're just chilling there now. <laughs> they're just there now. Yeah. They, they're just like stampeding still. Cool, 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 cool. Great. Awesome. Awesome. So, after you're done being busy, can I cast Speak with Animals? Yes. Okay. Let me know when you're ready. I will be ready in, let's say, about 20 seconds. I got this. All right. good Boop. and let's try <laughs> oh good oh good well if that's coming in I'm not gonna cast speak with animals I mean it's up to you but he's coming and he's like Pia's like god it damn it so that's one of the carnival people yeah probably can I roll to see if he recognizes me yes Come on, 90. Uh, 17. He super doesn't recognize me. Rough. Yeah. I may as well not even be a person to him. 
Yeah, you do not have the best track record with these people. To be fair, yeah. I feel like the, the dice don't like meeting new people. But Paez just comes up and she's like pushing through the elephants because she's actually roughly the same size as them. <laughs> she's like, get the fuck out of the way. Get the fuck out of the way. She, she does have to look up quite far at this person though. She's like, what the hell? Go on, go on. Gog. Hoglog. Glog. 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 He's like a murloc. Okay. He's a goblin. He gave up all of his his goddamn nouns and consonants. I did that specifically for because she likes the goblin. It's the noise. <laughs> <laughs> so I stand near enough by that I can hear their conversation, but not near enough by that I'm going to get smushed by an elephant. That is a good idea. Uh, she looks up and she's like, I know that you gave up all of the vows in your name, but did you have to give up on sanity? <laughs> And Glug Glug just looks down and he's like, oh, 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 oh. I whisper, can I like, real quick, like whisper to like Jem and say, hey, hey, where's the body? Where's that body? Oh, no? What do you mean you don't know? Florence, where's the body? I don't uh? know, meaning I never interacted with it. Florence, where did you put the body? Uh, she, she shows you where she hid it. It's like... It definitely look like it's resting on a bench. <laughs> Try to look at the cat. Okay, can I stealthily move the body to where it could conceivably be smushed by elephants? <laughs> <laughs> Originally, I had planned to just have the elephants keep running forward, but I wanted to see how you'd handle this, so I just left them there. <laughs> <laughs> Still smashing bodies, specifically. So, so can I move him, move the dead body stealthily so that Paez doesn't know? Oh, goodness, what the hell? I just messaged somebody who did something on accident. That's great. All right. Do I have to roll stealth for that? Uh, probably, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, probably. Wait, 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 before you do, before you do, you get some advantage because Florence is going to try to help. Help. <laughs> okay. Yeah, why not? I get, I get advantage then, right? Yeah, yeah. I would think so. Okay, so I'm going to roll. The cats are getting the zoomies, so if you hear any, uh, any crashing or banging around, it's them destroying everything I own. <laughs> Uh, 15 plus my stealth of 4, so 19. Yes! And Paez's attention is diverted, so you shouldn't have to roll perception at all. Right, right, right. I'm so smart. You guys? Please. <laughs> Please. Please. <laughs> Let's see how the, the hell it goes. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I like making my characters idiots. Me too. It uh, makes it a lot easier to explain away weird behavior. <laughs> to be fair, all my characters are made interesting and weird for a reason. But also in a very natural way. I didn't say a good reason. Good reason and common sense have been gone for a long time. Uh, speaking of, yes. So, Sorry, I just had to finish that message. And yes, so you should be able to... Go ahead. No, it's all right. Go ahead. What were you saying? I was going to say, I just, I stealthily try to move the body. All right. Well, and your, what was your stealth check again? 
18 with its advantage. teeth. So you should be able to stealthily move it while okay. while Piaz is talking to uh, Glug Glug. Oh. Yeah, that's it. So so I do that, and then I come back over here and I re re uh, restart listening to their conversation. Alrighty. So, so the body is now not our problem anymore because it's the fucking elephants that did it. You did take. I got a quick question. You did take the arrow out of that, right? It's... <laughs> mm. No, no, I didn't. Take the arrow out of that! <laughs> so I go back over and I yank, yoink the arrow out of his head. <laughs> It doesn't matter if I do it nicely. If they check how he died, it's going to be a problem. I fucking can't. I take the arrow out of his head, and I jab it into the wheel, and then I rejoin the conversation. Or, and then I rejoin listening range of the conversation without being all that noticed. Good. Oh my gosh, that's why you have to do everything, I <laughs> think. The arrow is out of his head, it's in the wheel now, it's- everything is fine. Uh, but anyway, as they're talking, you hear Paez and Glowog, and you can't really understand Glowog for some reason. Possibly because he doesn't use vowels. Is there even a word that doesn't have a vowel in it? Oh rhythm. yeah, yeah, rhythm. There's a bunch, actually, but that one's, like, one of the rhythm, decenter ones. Rhythm has Y in it. That is not actually a vowel. So, but I, I actually had to step outside time. for a moment, because it was getting too warm in the house. Because you made me you up with your problem. But that, that being cool. the thing, he just doesn't use vowels. That doesn't mean he doesn't use words with vowels. Oh. Oh, that's horrible. Yeah. Good luck. Good God. Yeah. Is that like an intelligence check to see if I can parse out his language? Yeah. Oh God. Oh gosh. Remember when I remember when I talked about how getting a twenty might not be the best thing sometimes? <laughs> well, Eleven. Eleven plus intelligence. Where is intelligence? Oh, plus two. So uh, thirteen. Yeah. No. No. You're too smart. You have no, you, you just can't. It is so beyond you right now. It's like, is this even the language? Oh my gosh. No, 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 please, no. Please tell me I'm not doing what I'm... Nope. Nope, too smart. Okay, so I needed a lower score. <laughs> He's like... Yeah, meanwhile, no. meanwhile, Paez is just like, yeah. I just... And they don't stop stomping. Why don't they stop stomping? I don't have a blog block. Just wait, do that a couple times and wait for Michael to freak out. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's kind of turning some of our, our carnival goers into paste. I think we should probably deal with that. I'm, I'm trying. Go go up here says that his elephants need to be exercised or they can't be juggled correctly. He juggles elephants? Yes, this is Glugglug the Storm Giant. And he juggles elephants. I look up at him. <laughs> I look up at him, see that his arm is thicker around than my whole torso. Oh, yeah. And I say, I say, okay. Then... Whatever, they, they... <laughs> it's like I can't, it's like there's no doing anything here at all. <laughs> just for, just for fear, for the reference, this guy's probably about 32 feet tall. Oh, great, that is... I'm like 5'8". I'm like 5'8", so... 5'9 on a good day. 5'9 on a good day, so I'm just like looking straight up. Yeah, he's, he's just like, mm. He is big enough to, like, basically palm these elephants. Okay. 
Okay, which... yeah, sure, sure. They can, they can exercise, sure, okay. And then I'm just gonna kind of walk away. So he just picks up like two of the elephants, one in each hand, and starts to walk off. I clap. I clap from my safe distance. <laughs> it's just he, it, it, the third one. He's like throws it, or he throws one and picks up the third one and starts juggling it, blood and all. <laughs> these oh these two both start running off this way, and he just starts chasing them while he's juggling. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. I swear to God, if you kill any more people, Glug Glug, you are getting a f demotion. You're going back to. Properly... Sorry. Uh, um, you want to see if your body got properly uh, mangled? Mm -hmm. Uh, let's roll our handy dandy D100. It trampled everything but that body. <laughs> Why is there one body here with an arrow? No, no, I yoinked that out and put it in the wheel, remember? Uh, like you're moving the wheel with the elephants. <laughs> oh, whoops. Uh, uh, Did not mean to do that. 96. I got a 96. Oh, well, yeah, that's some pretty good numbers. I mean, yeah, pretty much all the bodies there are just mushy pace. Okay, then we don't have a problem. Paez is just gonna look around and just be like, You killed someone, didn't you? No. Oh, uh, wait, what? You have to. No. You have to roll for no. this. <laughs> Te technically, you can be like, well, "I didn't kill someone," but those elephants <laughs> did. It's like the the elephants killed people, sure, but no, we're fine. So none of you, none of the people in your troop, killed anybody tonight. No, no. <laughs> so that. <laughs> All right, let's see. 16 plus 6, so 22. Oh, that's pretty good. Uh, definitely better than the 2 I rolled. <laughs> Just gonna look at you and say, you know, I think you're lying, but you've convinced me. I would never lie to you. Alright, well that's definitely a lie and you can't convince me otherwise. <laughs> you gotta roll with, like, disadvantage and minus 15. <laughs> I'm still get fucking 11. <laughs> Oh, uh, so, just getting no, natched 20. Uh, but yeah, she, she's just like, alright, well, I'm proud of you guys for not killing anyone tonight. Sorry about your tent. And Glug Glug, uh, if you want a monetary remuneration, uh, take it up with him. And she just starts walking off. But we can't even understand him. He's here at Florence saying. It's like, yeah, well, me well, neither. You can't understand him. <laughs> I mean, there's not even a magic spell that can save that. I mean, you know, I, it's every, I, I turn back to our party and I say, you know what, everything could have gone worse. Yeah, she gives a dirt, a give, a give, a give, a give uh, wedge a dirt ass look like garish monster. Yeah, we could have been, been blamed for Wedge's fucking stupid idiotic oh. behavior and I cast <laughs> vicious mockery. <laughs> Getting roasted by a tumor and his just tail look riding it. Wedge, you need to make a wisdom check, 15 save. A wisdom check with a 15 save, huh? Uh oh. Uh, and that's I love I have. I love that I have a plus three to my wisdom. Watch him still roll shit. Shut up, fucker! Don't jinx me. Damn it! Man, it's almost like I yeah, fucking yeah, called it. Yes. Damage. Four points. Oh lord, another ins an insight check. Uh oh, what was the insight check for? Cause sh the I no, said, I didn't. Okay, it was a damn convenience. There, there was, there was a conversation between Wedge and Jem. Oh yeah, that mean he was. Like, I mean, well, if things go smoothly with that stampede, it's all good. She's like, wait, you did that? I go, no, I didn't. But damn, was it con or, but damn, was it damn convenient? Gives a cheeky smile. That's when she did the insight check. Wedge is bad at English. Wedge is very bad at English. I mean, he, he has a knock Oh, man. Four. Four psychic damage. <laughs> From the vicious mockery, yeah. From uh, my insulting your idiotic behavior. Uh, I want I want it noted that you see Glug Glug coming back now juggling all five elephants. <laughs> uh, is he coming into our tent? Nah, he's just passing by back to the big tent. That's where he came from. 
You just hear glug glug, you're back! Whoa! I mean... You cannot drop another elephant in the crowd! Glug glug, we can't afford more crowds or elephants! Okay. Well, that could have gone worse. How do we... we could... How do it we could have? Leave? It could have! We could have been blamed for that person dying! On a well, different note, did we get someone a... here's fault? Yeah, but do you think that we'd all be punished for it? I don't want to be punished for his fuck up. I know, right? It's like I did a nice job on my performance, by the way. Uh, did we pay me? Well, uh, get tip. Uh, yeah. How does the how do we normally do the doling out of money? I mean, usually Gunter probably takes care of some of that. Yeah, and but how do we normally do it? Gunter's not here, Gunter. Not... Well, you're gonna have to yeah. function. You're gonna have to function as a unit without Gunter. Figure I out how he puts. Roll my carnival history check. Yeah, let's see. Maybe, maybe you've interpreted it or like talked to him before about it. I mean, I've gotten my share somehow. True. It's I'm true. normally outside. A uh, twenty-six. <laughs> okay. Okay. Jem knows everything. 26. When it comes to the carnival, yes. Yes. Uh, so you do know that he would usually divvy out anybody's, like, individual performances uh, after taking basically, like, a base cut for the entire group. So he would take roughly, like, 50% just to pay for everything that the group uses together, like living quarters, food, etc. And then after that, each set would be split along those lines. So, like, if you, during your set, 50% of it goes to the main pot, and then you split the setup between the people who are performing and working the crowd. Okay. So, for well, my 100 silver pieces, since that's a nice round number. You get 50 silver, Lissa. Gem, you get 50 silver. Um, who had 66? Minerva, Florence. Florence had 66, so Florence gets 33 silver, and if, um, if it's if it's uh, Vista, Windows Vista <laughs> gets uh, we'll round in his favor, in her favor rather. So gets eighteen silver. Nice. Put that down and I'll let Gamma know to add that. Awesome, yeah. Gamma had to go do some stuffs. Take care of some stuffs. Gamma had to go sleep. Yeah. Something like that. But yeah, that'll be good. That's also why I figured I'd throw in some stuff and get it close to the finish point, because I know we're about fifteen minutes or so away from our cutoff time. Yes, yes, it's a good time to wrap it all up, but uh, if anybody has some story stuff they want to finish up here and stuff, otherwise, you know, everyone has gotten the f out of the fucking tent. Obviously, the tent's going to have to be cleaned up. So, do we uh, do we sleep in the tent? Where do we sleep? That's a good question. You guys actually have a, uh, you know, residential tent area where you would sleep. Okay. Hi, Mabel. Um... So, when we all go to sleep, it's good to see you. I go to Jen. Sorry, the phone? Yeah. I'll be what? off in a minute, okay? Oh, no, it's just my nephew here. Oh, okay. I'll be sorry. right off, alright? He's done oh. in like five minutes. When okay, we all go to sleep, I change out of my costume, my fancy gold costume. Oh, I still have the gold, paint, the gold makeup on my face. Oh. But I go to Jem oh, well, and I say, Jem. I make sure Jem is alone. Oh, cool. Is Jem alone? Uh, that's up to you guys to get alone. Jem, Jem, I need to talk to you right now. Right now, come on. Trying to sleep here. Jem. I basically sit on her bed and poke her until she wakes up. Oh, also, all your shit has been moved around. What? what? Yeah. Yeah, all of your shit, like, in your living quarters has been moved around from where it usually is. 
you're just noticing like little things like say you left like i don't know something in this drawer it's now in the drawer to the left like you had something on the top of a dresser and now it's like on the foot of the bed stuff like that and so i'm sitting on the bed and i'm poking Gem, and i say wake up i need to talk to you i need to talk to you come on hold up hold up hold up but i've noticed this before i went to sleep yeah I was about to say. Yeah, a little bit. It might have been a tough day. You might have just passed out. I mean, it was a little you bit just interesting. Stayed out of it. <laughs> to be fair, just, uh, <laughs> he was just planning a distraction. You spent so much time stressing on whether or not to burn that whole thing down. <laughs> just finger on a hair trigger for like five turns. Like, do I kill it all? Roll for investigation anyway. <laughs> as as I know everything's there. Yeah, it's fine. It doesn't seem like anything's missing, just like it's all weirdly in weird spots. Back to Carly waking me up. What do you want? Yeah. I have a brilliant idea. We're in the room alone, right? Uh, the, the sleeping quarters, like, do we have to bunk up? Uh, that is up to you, your sleeping arrangements. There's enough room for everyone to have their own little tent, but essentially, yeah. Huh. It's up to you. If you want a tent there together. Oh, yeah, we're alone. Hashtag we're roomies. Alone. Hashtag roomies. Oh my god, they were roommates. So, I have a brilliant idea. Oh no. It's absolutely brilliant. Have I ever had a bad idea before? <laughs> the brains for a reason. I am true. You I are the smart brain. one between us. I have a brilliant idea. Okay. And I need you to help me. Be my muscle. Be my backup. Be your muscle as you talk to the person with a plus zero in strength. Be my backup then. Okay. What? What? What's this brilliant plan? I. So you know how earlier when, earlier today when you came up to me and it almost feels like three weeks ago i know but you came up and was like and you were like hey somebody talked to you about winning like a resistance yeah, that thing. rebellion that's the word i was looking for mutiny mutiny so i was realizing you know we don't really know all that much about the other side of this mutiny right So, my brilliant idea is that we could go do a little bit of recon. Because you know, the dark side of the carnival starts out at night. So they're gonna have, they're gonna be more active now. And now would be the perfect time to go and learn a little bit about the other side. Don't you think? Where are we going? Okay, we're going? We're going to the other side of the carnival. What? Right now. Oh, okay. Yeah, right now. Awesome. So, but remember, 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 we should probably be, like, a little bit sneaky. Like, you probably would be best to not be, like immediately recognized so remember remember Alyssa or Jem Jem don't be suspicious don't be suspicious oh don't Lord. be suspicious don't be suspicious and you have guardic inspiration for the next 10 minutes so you might feel a little lucky for the next 10 minutes just don't fuck it up and do we have time to go to the other side of the carnival or should we do that next time we're probably gonna have to do that next time as a small little preface while we get stuff okay. started because we got about like 10 minutes so we're probably better off ending it here than starting into a whole new thing i think most other people have also we've gotten to a point where we can trail off into next week into the mysterious disappearance of gunter yeah yeah we have we have i have given you an excellent cliffhanger I'm not gonna lie, it, you did, but everybody else 
coincidentally, by no plan of my own, is also <clears throat> heading in an awkwardly similar direction. Except for one person. Huh. Out, of, out of character, but yeah. I don't yeah, I know how that happened. Because I literally didn't think about it until I... I like, literally messaged Michael his piece of that and Jules her piece of that like a minute before you started talking about that and reminded me of yours. That Both of, is marvelous. It was very... Thing. I really wish I could show all the little side stuff because I don't have it all going on in the main chat. I got to remember to keep it all in there so people can see it on the videos, but... There's a lot going on in the side where I'm like, oh yeah, that's right, then this, and that, and that, and this, and this, and remember that, and this, and that, and my head's gonna explode. God, I really wish we run into each other when we're over on the other side of the oh, carnival. Right. That would be fucking hysterical. Daddy, you end up just missing each other. It's going to be yeah, a very... <laughs> <laughs> just it's going to be the the one where you're just like, like always me. yep just always yeah. one door away from where they're really at just closes door <laughs> opens doors like yeah and they were just there and it was this and that and this and then, and then closes door walks out the other pair walk back in uh, to be fair chasing clarence was kind of like that but he was already that's, that's okay wedge and azuva are gone gone, gone. gone. Oh. They're, they're gone. So, okay, hold I on. I would have been following them until bedtime. Yeah, unfortunately, uh, they use something to get away from you that is, yeah, one of those things. <laughs> Wait. Hold on a minute, Yasha. For, you, you stream to this to Twitch, right? Mm hmm Hypothetically yeah. then, hypothetically then, we could just go and watch it and figure out what the fuck they're doing. You could, which is the other reason sometimes I keep some of it off to Discord. I, even yeah, for, even especially now, like, I'll have to do special stuff because Diffy watches through the stream. So, so in, funny hates her. Yeah, so in order to take care of that, like, I have to keep stuff off screen that I might usually be having sitting, like, to the left or something where you guys can't see it quite, or etc. Like, Excuse you. Oh, so secrets are secrets for a reason, Ashley. But I'm I mean, curious. Uh, I want to know everything. So too bad. The best part is hiding secrets, and then you get to reveal them. Is like, oh, yeah, here's, here's what I did. While you all were talking with each other, I did a stealth roll to back away slowly and rolled an 18 for my stealth. Which is over everybody's passive. And I snuck away. To be fair, you guys have a fairly, like, if I'm not uh, totally incorrect, but I thought I was looking at it, and there's a fairly low level, at this level at least, of, like, just passive perception. Yeah, mine's like 14. Like, the highest is 16, I believe, and that is La Vista's. So. But, let me see, and so Pseudo Dragging Up is a 13. Yeah. Like I said, I, it was weird. I checked everyone, even his uh, line or whatever isn't that high. Um... But yeah, the everybody averages at around like averages, obviously not all of you, but it's like an average of like thirteen or fourteen. So the high yeah. being sixteen, the low being like eleven or something, or ten, yeah. or no, no, not yep, yeah. eleven, yeah. Because technically, uh, Diffie's character has really low perception, <laughs> but a great ability to hide. I'm a doll. <laughs> I'm a doll. Divi's been getting really good stealth checks today too. It's really nice. Fuck yeah, I, I'm gonna kiss. My she basically today. has rolled a 19 or 20 every single time. What she got? Well, what she, been doing? she didn't roll. Sorry, she <laughs> got a 19 or 20 every single time with her bonuses. I don't and, know what she's been doing. I don't know. <laughs> one of them, she did get one reroll because the dice was like landed at a bad angle. But it was either, it, it was like, an, one of them was an 18 and one was a 2, so we just had to re-roll it. Mm. And she got like a 15. And plus, most of my, I think most of my earlier rolls went to, towards the no. To be fair, she also doesn't roll on that much, so when she does roll, you know, she gets them rolls. She makes them count. She's gotta make them count. Yeah. As well as... Florence has been the show. And even despite that, a lot of you are still able to use like your active perception to be like, oh yeah, no, that came from the doll. A lot of you have done that so far. I haven't. Somebody has. Zooming. 
Wait, well, some of them like have like research and be like, is this coming from here? And I have to be like, well, yeah, you got the roll, so it's it's coming from right by that person or right by that thing. I, will, I never outright say it's the doll, but I'm like, yeah, it's on Wedge's shoulder. Yeah, it's. <laughs> yeah. I don't know when he sent me we, this whisper. We all. <laughs> oh, yeah, that, it wasn't too long ago. Yeah, only about half an hour ago. Okay. Yeah, it wasn't that important. It was something that I sent to everyone. Hmm. Because, uh, somebody did something. <laughs> <laughs> Kind of love those stealthy little dolls. But yeah, I think that's a good place to end it. We got to meet some more of the carnival. We got to do all our performances, which was good. Um, except for one person didn't finish their performance, obviously. And made no made no real contribution to the carnival. <clears throat> but, uh... Oh no, oh no. Uh, I caused chaos. I did a great job. Yeah, no, tell that didn't. to the people soup on the floor that everyone has to clean up. That yeah, had no. absolutely nothing to do with me. I did not cause that. You didn't help it, though, either. We <laughs> have slaves! <laughs> wow. Oh, wow. Uh, <laughs> like that. It was Gunter who did it. You, I know, I just... It's just so funny when it's ever oh. someone finally breaks down and just says it for what it is. It's like, yeah, basically you got these NPC slaves to do this shit for you. But you gotta yell them out by name. By name. I don't fucking know any of their names. Oh, 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 oh. Um, 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 um. Where's the thing? We've got Leroy. We got Steve. You Steve called. Intern. You called, good sirs. Steve. Steve, the intern. Really, you're doing such a great job here, honey. Uh, why don't you help clean up our tent? What the f happened here? It was such a fantastic, really one could call it a smashing performance. Uh. Smashing success. <laughs> In which, uh, you could just heal floor. I could just say that shit just went haywire and an unexpected stampede of elephant came yeah, through. But also, I could also say that it was a smashing success and then I get that pun in there. Of course, yeah, no, I can see where you're going. Steve, I, Steve I, is just like, I, you, 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 you. <laughs> How am I, I supposed to clean this up? I see what you're saying. Half the but tent I, is ripped I'm in half. I'm sorry that you're fishing for compliments. <laughs> oh, oh, the puns are real. I'm gonna go shoot myself. <laughs> Leroy, the transgender barmaid, just gets right to work. <laughs> if you can actually hit yourself. <laughs> oh. Don't. Shots fired. <laughs> That's another D4. <laughs> Once again. That is fucking <laughs> spicy. Which one said that? I did. Vicious mockery. Carly, Carly did. Oh, so yeah. <laughs> you can also I say to I say to Steve the intern we hate. Remember yesterday or earlier today when Gunter came in with those like four people we have in manacles for some reason? Yeah, well I there's only like three of those guys are like dead. Pretty sure Clarence ate them. I mean, Clarence, they disappeared, I mean. That's my buddy. Just find the one that's not dead. All right. And have them help you. All right, it's going to take all night. This is going to This is going to cost so much money to fix the tent. Thank you, darling. Uh, uh, just let me know how much it'll cost. Okay, I'll start working on the numbers. I got to go talk to Troll all the chess master. He's also the accountant. At your point, it's Steve. Definitely of, it's definitely coming out of party funds. Uh, at which okay. point, uh, at which point, one of the manacled people from earlier show back up, and a sec. Uh, I gotta type this. The party funds are the funds that don't go to you guys. It's the half that stays with the ringmaster. Yes. The ringleader. Yes. Okay. But to if you come out of more out of Aether and Archers, um, um, shot, uh, shot for hire. Mm. I feel like he can do the bulk, and also maybe we should go talk to Glug Glug. Since it was, you know, his elephant. I can't comprehend whatever he says. I'm too smart to understand him. You can try. 
<laughs> it's like I've, I've never met this problem before. I'm quite disturbed. Uh, uh, if, if, you're, if you're having a problem, well, then how do you think I can? <laughs> I'm the mage. <laughs> Keep this all in. I'm the one that is smart, uh, really into smart. Well, so, you, know, <laughs> you know, with the three of us, we're all ladies, and there's one language that speaks louder than words, and I sort of pulled down my shirt just a little bit. Just a little <laughs> bit. Just a little bit. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Crosses all barriers. I slapped my head in her face palm. That was, that's just, oh my god. This is the worst hentai I've ever imagined. <laughs> Why did I write this? No. No. I was, I was, <laughs> I'm just giving you shit. I'm just giving no. you shit, but it was too much. If his arm is as big around as my torso, what else is as big around as my torso? <laughs> oh my gosh, no! Lawrence is just like, no, how about this? I'll do you one better. I will cat. I'm will just gonna you, not. Uh, 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 all right, so we officially got Michael to, to quit, so that's one. <laughs> hey, I think I might understand Glug Glug. Uh, how about this? Intelligence? Uh, it's usually a roll, but I mean, if you have I a low... Rolled. Oh, well then, yeah, I mean... I got a two! Yeah, you, you might be able to understand Glug Glug, yeah. Okay, got a quick question. Would Comprehend Language do something for this show? No, he's... he's... no. He's talking more out of, like, stupidity, so it's not, like, an actual language to comprehend. He's basically yeah. fucking up a real language, so you can't comprehend it, because he's, like... Who, who has a negative one to intelligence and rolls a three. Me? Oh, Jim. Jim, are you finally the one who's going to be the point person in a conversation? Maybe. We'll find out next time on D&D &D Ball Z. <laughs> there we go. Oh, God. So yeah. Next week, just everybody, no, no more shooting the. <laughs> I just love it, Pat. Just, just tell me the truth. You killed somebody, right? <laughs> some somebody killed somebody, right? <laughs> okay, somebody may have killed somebody, but it, but it wasn't me. Or me. Uh, I, don't I don't think I drowned. All right. Well, I'm gonna well, I'm gonna call that well, good on the. <laughs> I'm gonna call that good on the recording and stream, cause yes. we'll keep going forever. <laughs>